EDM Q&A is all about top DJs worldwide answering your questions. Grab your phone, film your questions and send them over. In today's EDM's Q&A... Hi, this is Frontliner and I'm answering your questions from my studio. First of all, I want to say I'm really honored to have the opportunity to ask you a question. Uh, and you are really one of my heroes. And you produce different styles of hard style. From a more euphoric sound to a more raw style. Do you have a signature sound and how do you keep the hardstyle crowd satisfied about the sound? Well, actually, I, I like so many things that uh, it goes you know, several ways as you are uh, used of me. But uh, my signature is mostly uh, that I do different things and uh, I don't want to place myself in like uh, a little uh, uh, place called mainstream or raw style. I liked both and everything in between and, and that's what I want to make and that's why I do that. That's, yeah, that's basically it. <laughs> hey Frontliner, so you work with a lot of singers. How do you select a singer for a certain track and do you write the lyrics yourself? Well, I'm not a strong writer. I know uh, people who can do way better than me. Sometimes I have suggestions for words or for endings or, uh, or uh, singing lines. And how do I select them for my tracks? Well, it depends on the track, of course. Sometimes I work on a project and I look for someone, for example, with John Harris. We made a track, uh, Halos, and then I sent my track, and uh, how do you feel about this? And then he wrote and sang something on it. So it really depends on the track. And Katni Hall is here. Um, we are doing a performance on Mysteryland this year. And yeah, I found her through her agency. And uh, so yeah, it happens in, uh, in several ways. Will Hardstyle evolve in one specific matter? Or is there a new sound on the way? Of course, Hardstyle keeps on evolving because producers are getting better, uh, better uh, equipment, better parties, more fans, more, more places we go to. Uh, and for that uh, we also uh, uh, need to uh, actually consider the different crowds we are playing. But um, yeah, it will keep evolving because uh, we still grow our scene. But what defines hardstyle in my opinion is still the hard kick, you know, and uh, yeah, the, feel, the, the feeling when you hear it on a dance floor that you want to jump on it, you know, and yeah, it has a certain feeling and uh, yeah, if that feeling remains, it's still hard style. My name is Andrew from Laredo, Texas. At the end of 2012, you put a tutorial video on how to make kicks. Will there be more tutorials in the near future? I get this question all the time. A lot of fans want me to continue the tutorials and I really going to but uh, we still are figuring out what's the best way to stream it because um, yeah <laughs> we need a better internet connection for that and uh, as soon as that's possible then the stream will definitely start again so yeah it will come thank you for sending in all your questions um, and I hope to see you at one of my gigs <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>